Hello everybody, my name is Mathis and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac After Birth. Okay, we got Isaac, now it's time for Maggie. We're gonna be doing that rotation thing that I talked about before. Uh, Maggie is fine. Maggie's just boring. She's a fine start and uh, relatively speaking, she's a stronger start than most. She's just boring. Four hearts, a little bit, I think she's a little slower. Hmm, that's good, the virus is nice. Um, and Yum Heart, which, you know, we can definitely use to our advantage, uh, given enough time. Um, but all told, you know, Maggie's just not exciting. She's not Judas, where you get that power trip, uh, of having a, bu okay, Book of Belial to start with, which is awesome and always fun. Um, and then you don't get, you know, the Isaac D6 or the blue baby, like, oh shit, I'm gonna die, uh, because I only have Spirit Hearts kind of situation rolling. So you get only, you know, you you, you get, you get, I just walked into that like an idiot. You get Yum Heart. So, that's a thing, right, guys? Yum Heart? Yum Heart's great. Everybody loves Yum Heart. Alright. Let's just do this. Aw, oh, shit, son. We are gonna do some Yum Heart. Aw, oh, shit, son. Let's hope that we get something awesome in our uh, item room. Okay, don't, don't bother. Oh, oh, yeah, I was gonna say, I should be able to get him. Almost fucked it up. Hey, Mom's Contact's awesome. I liked freezing effects. Let's get our luck up so we can make more use of that. That would be awesome. Two bombs for brown chest. There's an argument there that that is absolutely worth it. But there's a better argument where I say I would rather have bombs for a possible uh, tinted rock. Now, we got a golden chest that paid out with two keys and a bomb, um, which is great. Uh, it's a very good payout. However, I would have preferred like spirit hearts or something. But that's all right. I'll live, live and let live, live and, and let die, live and let die. Woo -hoo -hoo. That's uh, I don't think that woo hoo hoo part is part of the actual song. But I won't let him walk into that fire until he kills himself. I appreciate that, friend, for walking into the fire and just you know ending your life for me is one of the the most friendly things anybody has ever done for me and Isaac. So thank you. Binky is a nice tears up. Always happy to have Binky. Now, my question to my to myself mostly is, do I give a shit about deals with the devil? Moreover, do I give a shit about trying to farm Crown of Light? Or do I just wait for like D6 Isaac runs to do that? I think that's a valid question. Ooh, you shouldn't have game, you shouldn't have, but you did and you're a doll for it. I don't know, do I want to, do I want to farm deals with the angel? I guess that's what it boils down to. Do I want to farm deals with the angel? I don't know if I do. I think doing it once every few runs is fine, but if it happens naturally, it happens naturally. I think I'm gonna just wait on having them happen on like Isaac runs or praying that I get it as like a starting Eden item. Only because deals with the angel fucking suck, <laughs> and I hate them. Mostly because they're boring. Let's just go do this right now. Pin, baby, pin. I love you when you come and say hello to me, baby, pin. You're a good man, baby, pin. Super bandage is awesome. Okay. We're gonna take all of this. This first. This second, this third, okay. We go boom, just for that spirit heart. And we didn't necessarily grab a damage upgrade other than obviously the nails is a damage upgrade, I guess, in once every six rooms. But we did end up grabbing a bunch of fun little benefits that could end up paying out for us big in the future. So I'm into it, I'm into it. That was that was a, a good grab and I think, uh, it could end up paying out for us pretty big if uh, all things go well. All right. And also, once every six rooms, we can just smash on rocks. That's something. Bob's brain. I think I have to say no. I don't like saying no, but I think I have to say no. Because it's Bob's brain. And we just grabbed three items from the deal with the devil, so I can't be too upset saying no to it. But I'm gonna say no to it because I just don't want to deal with the insert uncertainty rather 
uh, of Bob's brain accuracy, basically. Could regret it, but I think our damage right now and our DPS is serviceable. I don't think it's great, but I definitely think it's serviceable. And uh, we'll see how it goes. All right, let's go. Get this, uh, <laughs> okay. Let's, uh, let's be careful. Uh, be careful. Be careful. Dang it. Yes. Guppy. Nope. You know what? A spirit heart, some money, is, uh, is not a bad trade for having to fight a few, a few obnoxious enemies, I think. Let's just, let's just make them quick work. Uh, our survivability has gone up quite nicely with uh, the nail. I don't think I ever really, I've tried to, but I feel like I don't ever really give the nail enough credit. It's a better version of like Book of Revelations or, uh, is it better than Satanic Bible? I don't know, it's weird because they all have their own benefits, right? Well, they all give you a demon heart or a spirit heart every six rooms, but with the nail on that room you get uh, a damage up. Ooh, bombs are keys fine. You get a damage up. With Book of Revelations, you get a chance of fighting a horseman, which could give you Bandage Girl or Meat Boy. And with Satanic Bible, you get a Demon Heart, where if you take a hit, you end up more than likely clearing out a room. It's difficult. Like, which one's better? I think out of all of them, the Book of Revelations is maybe... Maybe the worst? And the, and the thing is, they're both fucking A-tier items. Or all three of them, are rather. Are all, they're all A-tier items to me. I should probably be using this. But it's tough for me to figure out which one I prefer. Yeah, that was going to happen. I had a feeling that was going to happen. That's fine. Um, Let's go hard here. I don't need ten bombs. Box of spiders is not great. I think we take speedball. Because it's the second one of the syringes we're going to have. So we'll just be one syringe away from the spun transformation, which is uh, is good. And I think that alone makes it worth it. Spun alone, I mean, uh, speedball alone is not exceptional by any stretch, but it's not terrible. It's just, it's like just worth it enough. Are we on an XL floor? We are on an XL floor, apparently. Pupula duplex. It's fine. Wide shots are all right. So we're likely not gonna get a deal on this floor because we got one on the last floor. So we'll see how this goes. I just wanna be very careful here. Okay, this is going well. This guy should be Relatively easy. Oh, give me that. Thank you. All right. Well, uh, an XL floor has its bonuses and minuses. Um, well, really, an XL floor is almost always a net negative unless it's on basement now that I think about it. Because not only are we are losing out on a deal with the devil, we're also losing out on a potential shop. And by potential, I mean absolutely we're missing out on a shop. Uh, and you don't really want to do that. Um... Still though, you know, it's it could be worse. Like out of all the curses, it's one of the more, I guess you call effective curses because it's a curse that actually does something. All right, I'm gonna hang on to this nail charge. I've not been using the nail as effectively as I would like. Mega Maw, we'll just fight him regularly. I'll use the nail on the next boss fight. I'm hoping it's not gonna be something terrible. Okay, goddamn spider. It's annoying, but we're fine. Oh, God damn it, he almost hit, yeah, he did hit me again, motherfucker. And we're gonna get a health upgrade, sure, with a shitty trinket, the Fallen. That's great, because it means we're gonna get a deal with the devil, even if we don't get, or rather, we're gonna get a deal with the devil item, even if we don't get a deal with the devil, which we're likely not going to get. Okay, we're gonna get hit here. Gimpy is awesome, and we are gonna get a deal, and it's, it's multi-dimensional baby, everybody. Oh boy, uh, I don't want Zeus, I don't need this. 
That is not, not what I want. Do you know what? Fuck it. Fuck the shop. Let's just go down to the next floor. I don't want or need it. We'll, uh, push onward, as it were. Another XL floor? Really? God. Game? Really? Like, the last thing I want right now is, a, like, a million XL floors. So, let's try not to do that. Alright. Well... I guess we look at this as another way of well, how do we how do we spin two XL floors into a positive? It's really hard to, because it just makes the floors feel extra long because they oh surprise they are, um, and we we get the negatives of just like missing out on a deal with the devil and no shop and all this other nonsense. All right, let's just clear these guys out. We do, we can spend a key for, well, it's just a battery, actually. It's not spending a key for a battery. We're just getting a battery because we get a key back. And we can get a, spend a key for two keys, which we definitely want to do. And we get another key here. So let's just do this. We actually don't even have to. We can just use that charge and get all the keys. So we, we netted two keys there. Ah, no, I tried. I tried to end it. I'm trying to use multi-dimensional baby in my favor. It's not working out well. But I did. I gave it my best gosh diggly dang effort, man. I did. All right. Just freeze them in place so I don't have to deal with this nonsense. And I actually ended up using uh, the nail kind of appropriately that time, finally. Not just hanging on to the charge for no reason. But we are now officially full on health. So, we're going to have to be, I don't want to say careful, but the nail is not going to be as useful as it was being. Mathis, you're an idiot. Okay. Well, let's continue. It looks like we're just going to hit dead end after dead end after dead end, which is also a goddamn shame. Are you going to hit me? You're not. Good. These floors, I always find, like, when it comes to XL floors, they, they drain me of my commentary the worst. Because they just not, they're not thrilling in many ways. They're just, they just cease to prolong the inevitable. Oh, God. Fart baby, everybody. Oh, shit. Fart baby. God damn. Uh, yeah, they just, I don't know, XL floors, like, drain me for some reason of just, like, any, any excitement. It's so weird. You're just like, XL floors, fuck them. Fuck them to hell, fuck this room. We're just gonna do this, because we just lost another half a heart. Ah, fuck you. Well, if we go to the shop, which we should absolutely make an effort to do. Um, ah, fuck off, almost got hit there. We should make an effort to go to the shop. Uh, double active, huh? It's alright. Maybe we'll end up getting something really valuable there. I kind of hope we do. We'll see. There was something I was going to say in particular. Like, I'm, I'm, I was looking for something in particular, but I don't remember what it, it was anymore. Because I got, like, distracted by almost getting hit. And it threw me off. And Kate, aka Probox Studio, youtube.com slash lovely, or Probox Studio, uh, sent me a DM asking to play Monster Hunter, which I may actually end up doing after this. If I have the time, I am in the midst of uh, working right now, but we'll see. Uh, best friend is obnoxiously useless. Not not thrilled about it. That is an amazing trinket. It's never too late to have paperclip. No, but I'll donate. We're about to hit over 200, and we stop at 199. Because life hates me. Okay. Well, let's just get through this fight. Brownie is annoying. But he's not the worst. There, He's still, I think, maybe is of this floor. Of the bosses we could get on this floor. And I'm trying to think what bosses those are. He might actually be, like, the worst. Okay, I'm just going to grab that. I'm trying to stay behind Farting Baby here. Alright, he's dead. Caffeine pill is 
fine. I'd rather have, uh, let's take it. Speed up, you know, it's fine. We're gonna pop this for the damage. Okay, that's fine, Mom. I don't, I don't mind it at all. You wanna drop me a guppy item is fine. I, don't, I guess we might take this with us now from here on out. I don't know. Do I, is the smart call to take Guppy's head? Probably not. But I, I value it more so than most items normally and I shouldn't. But I might do it because I have the survivability of a Thame or Athame plus a Gimpy which could carry me. We're going, we're going crazy here. We did get a deal. That surprises me. We are definitely taking the one on the left there. The mark for the damage. Or pentagram, whatever it is. Uh, is. I'm gonna look. No, no. I don't think I want Zodiac. Do I? It could be fun. I think I'm gonna leave it. I'm gonna keep Guppy's head. That was a tough one for me, because Zodiac has potential to be really fun, but is it worth basically fighting an entire goddamn uh, room of bosses for God knows how long? I think I had to like err on the side of no, it really isn't. I don't want to do it. So I decided not to do it. All right. So we're, we're coming on the on the winning side of things here, uh, as you can see. And uh, things are going well for us. Can't complain. Uh, all we need is one more syringe and one more guppy item and we can have at least one of the two transformations that we've been gunning for. The guppy transformation, not one I was really thinking was gonna happen. But I'm happy to, you know, pursue it if it does happen. Um, it's becoming more likely, clearly. But even spun would be fine. I'd be okay with a, a spun transformation. The damage is, is nice. And pentagram is obviously really good as well. Which I think actually ups our deal with the devil chances. And I'm just going to pop this and just use, use the card to speed along uh, the next room, which ended up being... Double monstros, which is fine. Multi-dimensional baby, hooking me up with some bonus damage every now and again. Man, the the tinted rocks have been really enjoying hooking me up with bombs recently. It's kind of been its thing for whatever reason. Up. Oh. Okay. Let's get that over there. We gotta check. It's Bob's curse. Was that worth the damage? No, but it's it's better than what the likely alternative would have been, which is like flies or bombs or something useless. I don't know if I would have preferred spirit hearts over Bob's curse, because there is an argument to be made that survivability is a little bit more important than five poison or just poison bombs and five of them or five extra bombs at this point, but, you know, we're not doing poorly, and uh, it doesn't feel like, you know, I was willing to make that risk knowing we it could have paid out in nothing, so to get something out of it makes me, like, feel like it's hard-pressed to bitch about the situation, and, man, I have to say, uh, Gimpy has been being a real bro. Alright. Okay. There's another Tinted Rock over here. Are Tinted Rocks guided by anything? Like, if my luck stat is high enough, am I more likely to get Tinted Rocks on my run? I feel like I should know this, and I feel like at some point I feel like I knew the answer, which is kind of why I'm asking it, but I don't know anymore. 
And I'm whether I'm questioning whether I did know the answer or not. I kind of hope I did. But I think the answer is like, yes, something does, or at least can guide the amount of tinted rocks you do get. He is just doing his thing. He's going to stay far back. We did get another deal. Krampus probably at this point would be my guess, and I was correct. Just kind of getting some fly action in there, some fly love. And I really don't give a shit about Krampus's head at all. I'd rather have uh, Guppy's head. Moving on to the next floor. And uh, feeling confident. I'm feeling the win in this one, man. Feel like it's gonna be a win. Ooh, that was dumb of me. That was also almost equally as dumb, but I had the invincibility shield. Almost got hit twice there. That would have been a shameful display. Are, do we have? Are we? What? Why do we have tiers that could go over rocks? Is that something with pupular duplex? I'm not realizing. Farting baby. I mean, you're a defensive item, I guess. I, I kind of appreciate you. Maybe I should appreciate you more than I do. I'll be honest, I don't. But maybe I should. Don't really care too much about that. Yeah, we're going to go in there. We have to. Even just for the smallest of chances, we had to make it. We had to make a go at it. Spirit, I mean, a uh, secret room. Had a weird gut feeling that was gonna be the case. Can I go up here? I cannot. Alright. Well, I guess we should go through the big room. Because it's likely this is gonna be the, the way then. Because big rooms are like a fetish for Isaac. They absolutely make you go through them almost all the time. It's fine. Everybody has their kinks. It's just when you force your kinks onto me, that's when it start, shit starts to get a little bit weird. Okay. God fucking damn it. Uh, I guess maybe the keys are valuable, but I don't think I care enough. Can we just kill you off? Thank you. If we were, like, our run is good. I think a lot of it has to do with our DPS being pretty damn good. But if we could just get, like, a little bit of a damage buff or something, we could just speed this run up a little bit. That's all I want. I just want to speed the run up just an inch. And an inch might be the wrong term, but just a little bit faster. That's all I want to do is make this run just a tiny bit faster. It's going to move here behind Fart Baby. Don't want to get hit. Get behind fart, baby. It's working out. We did it. Another deal. We'll take it. Cambian Conception is not very good. Uh, I was, I guess I was going for the Hail Mary Guppy item. Probably shouldn't have, because... We're not in a particularly strong place now, health-wise. But, I had to try, man. I had to give it my all. Alright, this is where things are going to get a little bit... A, I don't want to say iffy. Uh, but this is where you're going to start realizing our damage is not that great. As these rooms will probably drag a little bit. This is where our play is going to come into, into play, I guess. But... If we do take a hit, we have a chance of Gimpy paying out. And we can run into people and do poison damage and hope for another payout there. So let's hope it works in our favor in that way. Okay. Well, you're a dick. And I don't like you very much. Let's keep moving. If we, uh, why pick up the money? If we get, um, money equals power. That could pay out nicely for us, man. The the uh, Isaac fight is going to be a bitch. I'll tell you that right now. It is not going to be fun. It is going to be a hell of a chore. Okay, let's move. 
Oh, Monstro 2. God, you're annoying. Ah! Fucking... Fuck. Alright, we did not get a payout there. That was just a long-ass fight, and uh, it wore me down faster than I wanted it to. Okay. We should maybe try and use our orbital just like a little bit more. Alright, let's get the hell out of the way. I do not want to lose one of my lives already. We only have nine of them. Okay, good. All right. So far, they have not paid out the way I would have liked. I'm gonna... Head of the Keeper. Interesting. Our tears are gigantic all of a sudden. Uh, flashing light warning as always with Head of the Keeper. If you have sensitivity to flashing lights, beware. There will be many of them. You guys go after each other. What was I hoping for out of that golden chest? I guess maybe like a spirit heart drop or something. Chub. Didn't even see you there. I was hitting you. I think I froze you while you were invisible. Almost actually got hit there. That would have been a, a poor play on my part. Is it going to be... That's it. Okay. Well, maybe it can be in conceptual payout with Dark Bummer. So, oh, there goes that life. All right. I'm just trying to bait now. Okay. We're having issues. Come on, you got... Yeah, all right. That's what I needed. Okay, do not take a hit now. Let's get through this room. All right. We're um in a bit of a sticky pickle here. Just be smart. Get through as many rooms as you can. That's all I want out of you, Mathis. Just power through. If we die on this room, it would suck, but we wouldn't have to come back to it. So let's try not to kick it on this room, shall we? Feel like we can make that happen. Okay. This room does suck a lot. So I'm going to try and skip it. I think that's fair. This room also sucks a lot, but it's a manageable suck. If you can manage the suckitude, you're in a better position than you were when you couldn't. Okay. Got him off of his damn high horse. You like that? Oh, that was funny. We're definitely going to try and bomb out of this death room again. Please be the right way. We gotta get out. No tinted rock in a room that almost always has tinted rocks. And there's our boss fight. All right, we gotta play exceptional. And Fart Baby might be the key if I don't play super well here. Oh, I thought I was behind Fart Baby there. Oh shit. Trying to get some poison in. It didn't work. Did get a freezing shot in there. Let's see. Can I stay here and have the tears hit? It looks like I can. This is very good for us. Can I get to phase three, though? All right, we're going to have to move now. Oh, shit. The corner needs to work. Oh, my God. It actually did. All right. We're on fit. What? There was a goddamn fucking angel baby still there. Ah, oh, fuck off with that shit. Are you serious? All right, don't move. Just gonna have farting baby do his thing. Try and get through this phase super fast. I'm gonna grab this. I wanted to hold out on that one for as long as I could. Oh, fuck. Come on, you gotta get to phase three. Oh, God, please don't kill me here. We're good, we're good, we're good. This should not be as goddamn dangerous as it is. Do not get hit. Okay. Okay.
Just get you to teleport. That's all I need. Okay. Get me out of this fuck corner. Nope. I don't like this. Okay. His tier pattern actually changes up. I didn't realize. Come on. Oh, please, no. We can do this. Okay, I think we're gonna make it. We are. Woo, we made it. Oh, shit. Well, this is more dire than I wanted it to be. Oh, that deal with the devil, I shouldn't have taken it, man. The D fucking six. Yeah, we're re-rolling. Um, I think what I do is I take all of these, and then I take this and I sleep. And I just get four new items. Oh, they're so bad. Okay. Um, hmm. There's no chance of re-rolling them, so we just gotta take what we can get here. Uh, the fact that the only damage up we got was in uh, oh fuck, do not get hit, do not get hit, in the, that goddamn thing. I can't even think of the name of it. Okay, this is a good step. Infestation two is a very good pickup for us right now. Anything to up our damage. And spawning spiders, even if they're through killing enemies, is big for me right now. Um, God, the, the, the freaking crown of thorns there. And I, for some reason I can't think of the name of it. That's our only damage up? That scares me. Okay, we gotta make this work. Maybe more bombs might not be bad? Okay, well, if we're just gonna do that. Okay, we bought ourselves a hit. That's, uh, that's something. Oh, fuck, super lust, right. Forgot about you, I'm not gonna lie. You're more important to me to, to die here. And there is a goddamn, I had a feeling it was gonna happen. Uh, um. A tear there. Come on, you gotta go. I need to save as many fucking spiders as I can. We can still do this. I have absolute confidence we can still make this work. Ah, I should let the key bum be picking those up now. I have no reason to be picking them up. Okay. Also, I'm not at half a red heart anymore. I thought I was. Something, I must have picked up a red heart somewhere along the lines accidentally. Which I did not mean to do. You gotta go. You've gotta go, man. Nope. Ah, fuck. I have a feeling this is the way I'm gonna need to go. Come on. Wow, okay. That worked. Okay, we got one. Keep up, I hope you got that. I think I did, but I was hoping it was gonna be you. I also need to kill you guys off so he doesn't do weird, weird uh, brimstone attacks. Thank you. Nope. <laughs> nope, 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 nope. I do not hate myself that goddamn much. Well, two lives. Right, you need to bounce in a better way. Come on, Frere. One of you's just gotta go. This is getting a bit much for my tastes. Uh, okay, we'll go this way. Alright, be careful. I'm just scared. I'm in like, hyper concentration mode. 
and I'm absolutely terrified. I'm trying to take out as many. Ah! Ah! I saw the bullet at the last fucking second. I'm gonna. I, this is very losable now. This is incredibly, incredibly, incredibly losable. Which is goddamn shameful. You gotta go. Don't think they have the range to hit me. Hey, secret room. Pill. Lemon party. Mr. Mega. Okay. You know what? F this room. Everybody come have a lemon party with me, alright? Everybody wanna have a lemon party? Come have it. I know what I'm saying. <laughs> I'm well aware. This has been some horrible, horrible item payouts on the chest, by the way. We have a total of 4, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 items. Maybe 13 or 14 items total. And they've been all very disappointing. Really? Really? This is going to be a shit room for us? That's fine. Alright, um, can I go over here? No, okay. Well, this is a, a dead end for us. I guess we should go through the bigger room. There's our boss fight, because of course there's our boss fight. If I can get through this room without taking a hit, aka not dying and losing a life, then I think we're in good shape. But I am very scared. And I, I hesitate to say good shape, but we're in better shape than having to do this room again on one life. Come on, you gotta go. You gotta drop me something, boo. No? Alright, let's do this. Stand behind Fart Baby and pray. Let us fucking pray. Just don't move and fucking hope. Fart Baby, you win this for me, baby. I'm gonna be the happiest man that you've ever met. Alright. Gonna throw in another bomb. I think we might be able to pull this off. Get in there, man. Do not get hit. Holy shit, we won. Yes! Oh! Oh, hit that chest. Get me out of here. Oh my god, we did it. Holy crap. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye!